Hey guys, it's Liz. Welcome back. So today's video, you're going to be coming along with me as I go to Costco. Haven't been there in a while, so I do have a pretty good amount to pick up from there. But then we're also going to be heading on over to Trader Joe's, but we're really only going to be shopping for like the snacks and like the frozen foods because those are really good. And I haven't been there also in a while because it is pretty far for me. So today we're going to be making a trip cross town and we're going to be getting all of the goods preparing for the new week. So Costco, we're going to be picking up mostly all of like the groceries for the week. Um, we have to stock up on all of our proteins, our produce. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and leave two of my shopping lists right here. So this is going to be the meal ideas that I plan to make this week. And here's going to be the Costco shopping list. Everything I'm going to be picking up is going to be on here and maybe we'll sneak in a couple things here and there but yeah so if you guys don't know i have a huge family we are a family of six or five six <laughs> <laughs> like there's so many i forget so i feel like costco is very necessary for when you do have bigger families or if you guys just like to eat at home and like to bulk buy and just like have food so you don't have to go to the grocery store so often costco is always really cool so i'm going to show you guys everything that we like to pick up from costco and also incorporating into the meals for the week. Yeah, so if you guys want to come along, come along. You got me, it's so shit. I'm so high up in your shit. This is why I'm gonna gift Eric, because he's such a dad. Or such a cook that he likes stuff like this. It's pricey though. To me, that's pricey for one of those things. Is this an air fryer? Like a bougie air fryer. This is what we should get. We should give it ourselves for Christmas. It's on sale too. For 80 bucks, originally 120. I kind of want to find the smallest dang air fryer ever because that's the issue I have with air fryers for some reason is like I'm just taking up so many so much space and I'm like I don't have much cabinet space for all of that. Look Ember's name. Emmy. Look Emmy, that's your cool. <laughs> She's all smiley, go. Look at the Christmas stuff. I always have this issue with Costco for some reason. Like their Christmas stuff is just way too bulky. Way too like giant. Like Target has like a miniature one of this. And it's like really cute color aesthetic. And I don't know. I just prefer to get smaller things. <laughs> but those are cute. Look at Mickey ornament set. Something I'd probably get here though for... Our next place is um, lights for the outside because you probably get so much for like a big house. That would be cool. Do you like that? Look at for Ezra. Oh, some gift ideas, guys. The scooter's really cute and it lights up. Oh, it's an electric bike? Heck no, they gotta actually do it. You guys ain't gonna be lazy. Look at Baby Yoda. Oh, look at how cute this is. Yes. It's so soft. I can see you guys like laying on it, but it's kind of a waste of space. <laughs> okay, throw him back in, Emma. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this one's so cute. This one's fifty bucks. That ain't that bad because I seen one for like so freaking expensive. Oh, look a Lego set. Oh, I'd probably get this for Ethan because he loves Legos. Oh, this is a good gift. All right, guys, so we're going to head on over to the clothing section. I'm on the hunt for some pajamas for Ezra. He grew out a lot of his. This is like just random pieces of pajama he has left. So we're going to try to find some cute ones. And probably some jackets, too, just to see what they have. Oh, look, babe, they're cold weather jackets. This is cute, Timberland. Be cute for Ethan. $35. Ember, look, Ezzy, what kind of pajamas do you like? <gasps> look at Christmas turtle jammies. This is for Ethan, not Ezra. Look, guys, show them your turtle. Wow. He's obsessed with turtles. I feel like these are kind of random. We're going to keep looking. Wow, Ezzy, what jammies do you like? Oh, these are adorable. Look at these, babe. These ones are so cute. Let's try to find your size then. Oh, these were really cheap too. These were only $10.99 right now. 
They're on sale. Mm, why do they always have to do the boys like this, though, huh? These are pretty cute. Look at oh, little koalas. For Tutti and Tutti for Ember. Or we could do unicorns. I kind of like unicorns. <gasps> Did you hear what Daddy called you, Ember? He called you a gunk. Ember, which one do you like? Which one? Pick. Oh, she likes the unicorn. Yay. Very cute. Look how many cute options they have for the girls. But they do the boys like that. Like a couple little options over there. <laughs> you guys, this is actually a really good gift to buy a young kid. Or actually any kid age. Like these range from like way high. But these, like the kids are obsessed with. And they just keep them busy for a long time. Wow, Zizi! I want to get one! You like those? Yeah, I want to get that for Christmas. Oh, you want that for Christmas? Oh, yeah. Okay, I'll. Santa will write it on his list. That could be a good sharing toy for Ezra and Ethan. So we're pretty much done with all of, like the clothes and stuff. So now we're going to actually head on over to the grocery section. We're going to start off with the produce. <laughs> this is so cute! Ethan, which one are you? Show me. Which one's Ezra? Where's Emma? <laughs> Where, where's me? Oh, thanks. This is so cute. Would you guys want this for Christmas? Daddy. Oh, and that's Daddy? Yeah, it kind of looks like Daddy, huh? That is so cute. Would you guys want this, though? Yeah. Emma, what are you doing, child? You're relaxing on Ezra? Oh, so cute. Fruits, banana, strawberries, grapes, cuties, and blueberries. Organic. We're gonna just stick with the regular ones. Ooh, I think we're gonna do raspberries too. Cause you get so much. They're four forty nine right now. I don't think they have strawberries here. Some bananas, some grapes. You gotta check them though. Make sure they're hard. We don't want soft grapes. Emma, you look comfortable in there. I like the decoration you use for the wipes. Yeah guys, so we like to bulk buy on our chicken drumsticks and thighs because it's always gonna have those on hand. Gotta grab one of these. Nice and warm. Look at that chicken. You see this chicken? It's hot. It's hot. Look at Emma's decorations, guys. On the shopping cart. You making it into like your little room or something? Yeah. <laughs> There's one behind her too. So I actually switched my detergent, you guys. Um, I haven't been using like the blue one because I feel like every time I use it with my sucky washer and dryer, like it just like ends up with like blue splotches. So I've been using the free and clear because it doesn't happen with that. So, and it's only eleven dollars. So, For a lazy day, I want to try these out. Two cauliflower pizzas for $10.69. You know, we always have those lazy nights where we don't really want to cook. Pop one of these bad boys in the oven. Dinner's ready. Gluten-free too. Right, guys so we are back first I'm gonna show you guys everything I picked up from Trader Joe's unfortunately a lot of the things were sold out which I kind of figured because of course I want to go on the weekend and there were just so many people there so I'm pretty sure a lot of the items were picked through but let me go ahead and show you guys what I ended up picking up I got three yukinis some baby carrots for the kids snacks Emma's actually a kid that loves carrots so I like to put these in her lunch boxes and we also got some cocoa almond spread. The kids love Nutella sandwiches, so I thought I'd switch it up and get some of this. We haven't tried this out before, so I'm curious. 
to see if it tastes like Nutella. I'm pretty sure it will. And I like this with breakfast. I'll put like banana slices in it and they'll have like a Nutella banana sandwich. But this one will be cocoa almond spread. So I seen these, I haven't seen these there before. These are dark chocolate drizzled plantain chips. I love plantain chips and I love anything with chocolate on it. So yum, I'm excited to try these out. And then these I get all the time when I go to Trader Joe's. These are the pretzel slims. They go by too fast, but they are so delicious. They're dark chocolate covered and so, so good. I also got the kids a small little pack of the Squishers. And this is in the flavor cherry and strawberry. Ember actually had one in the car. They're kind of just like go -Gurts, but they look like this. And then I also got some of these acai bowls. So I like these for a snack or sometimes breakfast. So they're just like the acai packets. So I actually went there specifically for their chicken fried rice. That is so bomb and so quick and easy to make, but they didn't have any, like they had no none of it. Like so um, I ended up getting some of this beef and broccoli. We tried this before, me and Eric liked it. The kids didn't like it, but me and Eric liked it. So this is gonna be a nice lazy dinner for us. And then I also got some Roman salad with some arugula and I haven't tried this dressing before and I'm curious to see if I like it or not because I didn't like the Caesar salad one so I'm hoping I like this one I'm pretty sure I will because it's spicy and it has cashew butter lime juice ginger cilantro and red chili peppers so that seems something I would like and that is pretty much it for Trader Joe's guys moving on to Costco so these are great to have on hand we have like two in the refrigerator we'll stick like two packages inside and then store the rest in the pantry these go by really fast with how many kids we do have and they get this sometimes they don't get this all the time so they'll have this like once a day with whatever meal um, probably dinner or lunch and then I also needed some new laundry detergent and like I was saying in Costco I kind of want to stop at least for now and, and until we like move into our next house and get new washer and dryers. Um, I want to stop getting like the blue liquid because it's starting to stain our clothes a lot and it's leaving like little blotches and ruining some of our clothes. And I noticed with the free and clear, it doesn't really do that. So I got the free and clear. It's so cheap, you guys. It was on sale for only like 11 bucks. So it was a really good deal. And then we also have some downy. This is just traditional downy. And I think this was on sale too. So yeah we got that so for one of the dinners we are going to be using some rotisserie chicken and um we got it rotisserie chicken they actually sell like pre-shredded ones but i was like you know what let me just go ahead and shred it myself because it is cheaper and we only need it for one meal so we're gonna go ahead and do that um but i suggest if you guys do use like ready to go meat um definitely check out the shredded one that they do offer just a little bit more pricey it's a little bit more convenient but I'm just going to shred it myself and we're going to be making chicken enchiladas this week. And then I also needed some hangers. If you guys didn't know, Costco has an amazing deal on hangers. You get 50 not slip hangers. They're the black velvet and they are $15. Sometimes they're even on sale. You can get it for cheaper, but unfortunately they weren't on sale. So I had to get it for 15 bucks. But I think all in all, pretty good deal. And as you guys seen, we got some PJs for Ember. I think the pajamas are always such a good still at... Costco, you can get some really cheap ones, especially when they're on sale, and you get a two pack. So this was, I think, 11 bucks because it was on sale. So we got her these pretty little unicorns, very nice for the winter. We also got a two pack of the Hawaiian bread. Just Emma actually, we were this was even on the list, but Emma seen it and they love this for like literally any meal. They just love like a piece of bread on the side of it. We also got some David's Killer Bread. So we do like the idea of just sticking it in the freezer so that way we don't have to go to the grocery store during the week and we could just thaw it out once we're done with one of the loaves of bread. So yeah, it is a lot, but if you guys, you know, of course have multiple people eating sandwiches, eating bread, this is always a good find at Costco. And then we also got some blueberries. The fruit is always a go-to, a staple, especially in our house. The kids, like whenever they're hungry, if they finish like their breakfast, lunch, or dinner, we're always like, just grab some fruit. So we always like to have like different multiple like fruits because fruit is live. It's nature's candy. So we have some blueberries, some raspberries. This was special. We don't really get raspberries that much. So I'm excited. We kids love raspberries. We also got some purple grapes. These were on sale too. Pretty good deal. I forget how much, but I'll throw it up right here. Some bananas. Bananas are always a really good still because 
They're so cheap. <laughs> and then we also got some mandarin oranges. They're actually in season, so they're really good right now. And then we also ended up getting some raw tail off shrimps. And I'm not sure if it was an amazing deal or anything like that, but we just needed it. And we do like to make shrimp often. So we do like picking up our proteins and kind of just sticking it in the freezer. And you guys already know I've been raving about these Just Bear chicken nuggets. They are freaking amazing. If you guys haven't tried them from Costco, I highly recommend you guys. These are my favorite nuggets from any place, you guys. Like, no matter what place you'll take me, I always think... These nuggets are the best. Eric thinks I'm crazy, but I really, really love them. Um, they taste similar. Do they taste similar to Chick-fil-A to you? Um, yeah, but... I like um, these better. Yeah, it's, it's hard. That's a close one. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy, but these are really good, especially for being like, you know, you could just put it in the oven. I feel like they're really, really good. So... Um, yeah, we also ended up getting some wontongs. I actually forgot to put this on the list. This is Eric and I's go-to for lunch. Ember actually likes them too, so we make it for ourselves and Ember. It's on like... sale so cheap too. Oh, how much? It was like six like... bucks. Yes, they're crazy. Six bucks for so many dang wontongs, you guys, and they're delicious. And then we also have some Kirkland Organic Greek Yogurt Plain, non-fat. Some organic eggs. We also have some chicken thighs. We like to cut them. So they're individually like stored in the freezer and then just take it out when we're ready to make it. We also got some turkey bacon. We do the exact same thing. The chicken from Costco, you guys, freaking amazing deal. You get so much and I like how they're wrapped and they're, I don't know what it is too about the groceries. Sometimes I feel like their proteins are kind of gross, like especially like, I don't know. It feels like they've been out for a little bit too long. Costco's always seem really fresh to me and I stick it right in the freezer as soon as we come home and we cut them, stick them in the freezer and they stay fresh you guys so I really like that and it saves me from having to like work with the chicken and store it and all that annoying process and then we have some cauliflower crust pizzas you get two we haven't tried this so I'm actually really excited to check it out and to see how it tastes and then we also got some organic milk for the kids so I do drink oat milk I tried to like introduce that to the kids but they just do not like it you guys they really like regular milk and ember likes her regular milk too so um i tried even giving it to her before she ever even had regular whole milk and she just didn't even drink it and i was like dang the last thing we ended up picking up is this delicious trail mix you guys this trail mix is so bomb and the white little things right here so at first we thought these were white chocolate but they're actually yogurt chips and so freaking good like all of these together just amazing so it has almonds cashews cranberries yogurt chips and blueberries and the blueberries are freaking good it's like dried but it's it's amazing you guys and like literally everybody loves it and i like how it doesn't have any chocolate in it because you know like those tromlicks they have like chocolate and a little bit of unhealthy stuff <laughs> if you guys have kids you know they usually tend to pick out all the chocolates and stuff but this one I think Emma's the only one that doesn't like cranberries, but everybody else doesn't mind the cranberries, so it's really cool. So yeah, guys, that is basically it for today's video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Also, if you're brand new, click that subscribe button and ring the bell to get notified every single time I upload a new video. Um, so, you good, Ember? You good? Yeah? <laughs> so yeah, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and start putting everything away.